So if you did not catch the plucky squire before, um, I am Jot. That's me, the red red hat, little feather. I can travel in 2D and 3D realm. This game is about adventuring, puzzling, little storytelling. Not very heavy on the story. More about adventuring and then a little bit of puzzle. There are some puzzles of like, you know, um, typical puzzle. Some puzzles are like word puzzles like uh, Baba is You. And then we basically have to save the world. That's about it. And then it has a little bit of combat like this and the boss fights are specially designed which is pretty interesting. And then we're on this mountain which is the home of my friend. I forgot this guy's name. This is it's his house. And it's getting attacked so we're here to save the mountain from it being attacked, I guess. Thrive, that's it. I'm assuming we need an item. The pass. Okay, we need the pass. Guys, it's so dark, I can't see. Hello? Wait, do you think the past is not in this world? Rather, the past is... Manipulate. I don't see any past though. What is this? It's a coin? Oh, we did also see Thresh's uncle die. Why is it always turning face? That's where he died. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. What do I do, Che? What do I do? the little wizard guy that I can ask questions to. Oh wait, do I? Wait, 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 wait. Maybe I just need to go to the dungeon? No, that's art. Once upon a time, there was a young but a plucky squire. That's me. Maybe just go. All right. 
You look for the pass? We got pass! Locked in red chest, mate. Pass locked safely in chest. But if you clev if you clever, maybe you get it. Oh, okay. Why is the rabbit so happy about it? This mine was ancient and rather gloomy. It is a little gloomy. They're like the gigantic bones. MB2 Jot. Yo, just checking in quite a dingy spot you found. That thing in front of you looks like a minecart. I bet it will roll around that rail if I were tilted. Have fun, lad. Moonbeard out. Manipulate. We want to tilt it. I guess that's fine, right? We can just jump from that. Who's this guy? Ah! What the heck? Oh, of course! We need to get something. I think we need to kill everything? To open that gate? Oh no, wait, there are some buttons. What does this do? It's a bridge. Okay. What does this do? It's a bridge to that. Okay. Pick it up. And we'll put this one down here. the key put it down here get the key Okay. That red chest got unlocked. Manipulate. Just a little bit. No, 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 no. Thing stops there. Come on, just tiny bit. No, oh, are you kidding me? This thing is not about it's it's either stops there or stops there. Okay. How the hell do I get there then?
Am I not seeing something? I guess I I guess I won't be able to get the one in the middle. Wait, what? Was there a portal here? What? Maybe a bug? Seems like a bug. Let me guess, it's in the other chest? Fucking kill this rabbit, dude. Okay. Stop there. Stop right there. like a pass cracking jaw now you can open that gate and continue your climb with thrash onwards and upwards here we are dude you're back from another jaw haunt and hey, you've got a pass, metal. Let's open these gates. Or do I just... Yeah! Yeah! You may have said... Wait, what? Our heroes climbed the sheer <laughs> cliff face. What the hell? Ascending to even greater heights. That's crazy. Yoo-hoo! Is that his uncle who's dead? Krong? Hello again, just dropping in. Mountain trolls who have ascended to Trollhalla can barely return to the mountain. If we have business that is important enough, and I do, namely training you in the ways of the metal warrior Thrash, this cloud is rental, so I'm rather short of time, so let's get to it. Come here, my boy. Let's see if you've got that trog spirit in you. Said Krog. And thrash. Oh, they Accepted the challenge. Bro went big. How do I play this? Also, oh, it's a rhythm heaven? Okay! Music major, music major.
Music major, music major. Let's go! Rock on, brother! You got the better of me, young one. I am dead though, so it does tend to melt one of it. <laughs> you will have to step up your game if you're challenged by a feisty living opponent. Oof! The rental limit on my cloud just ran out. Gotta go. Don't want to deal with the late fees. Good luck, you two. I'll be watching. That'll... So long, Prong. That was kind of fun, dude. Haven't had such an intense drumming workout for a while. Feeling pretty amped. Let's zip on ahead. Do I see a real bolt? Crew received. Crew transportation commands. That thing looked kind of gnarly. Hello, Sprout. That massive screw thing, it's not from our world. It seems that Humgrump is bringing metal part into our land from the outside realm. He's pilfered all that metal junk from another book on the desk. Cannot be a good news. It never is with that nitwit. Hurry up to the peak. See what Humdingus is up to. <laughs> what the heck? Didn't they always call him Humdinger? That was a Humdingus? Doesn't this look like a secret? Hello, rabbit. Hello there. Excuse my shivers. There is a big horrible rat around here that is giving me a heebie-jeebies. The rat's in the dark hole. If you walk in front of it, it will pounce and eat you! Certain do, mate. Unless if you could find some cheese around here, you could distract the rat. We could all avoid death by rodent and you could safely be on your way. Win-win, mate. Here was a big wooden block. Ah, so we want to change that into a cheese block. We want to see the rat. I have never died before. Just dusted himself off and arose to fight once more. I want to see that. That's cool. There gotta be something here, right? What? Why is this half of page black? Okay, we need a key. Hold on. Well, unless we can find something in this world, which I don't think we can. I think the morning sun is coming out. I think nothing changed here. Hold on. Let's go back in. Uh, there's something something in that dark page for sure.
What is this one? It's just the wall? It's not even a wall. It's like a roof. Hmm. Maybe I should ask Moonbeard. Mini Moonbeard. a bother. Ah, and then we can take the metal. So then... I think we gotta first move the wooden block. No! What the hell? I did what? That is exactly not what I did not say I would do. Are you kidding me? Whoops. Okay, so I guess we need to change it into the metal. Okay. Metal first. Hopefully it will move though. Hopefully it will slide. Oh yeah, it slides. Don't look at that, baby. What's this? Glowing, glowing. Here was a big glowing block. We gotta try it. I want to see a glowing block. What? What? It, what would it look like? Ooh, very nice. It was rather gloomy in the cavern. More spikes, huh? What are the bones for? Bones are decoration. Is my friend okay? Cheese crumbs dotted the ground.
Oh my gosh, I'm so stupid. I'm keep going down thinking I need to get out of the book by going down. Kind of terrifying, not gonna lie. Brilliant job, mate. Once again, she saves the day. The rat is really going for it, huh? You can be on your way now. I may follow you later. I want to watch the concert. Con concert? Concert of the rat eating cheese? Snakes. Ah! But what the heck? What? Another one? Who put all the snakes here? Ah, what the heck? Whoops. Sorry, Thrash. I didn't mean to abandon you here. Think thrice doesn't have HP bars. Jot. I may not have mentioned to you. I'm just a wee bit nervous around snakes. It's quite embarrassing to be honest, dude. Let's put this one down in the column of self-improvement. <laughs> Burr. Wait, he's cold? What is Burr for? Boy got cold? Sh oh, shivers maybe. Shivers from seeing all that snake. My heart didn't stop. Good job, little heart dude. I'm a heart dude? That's Thrag, the legendary metal warrior jamming out. They say he transmits his energy to all who lives on the mountain. You know, growing up here, I never really got it. But now I'm starting to feel some of that mountain troll fire, huh? Hey, you two. I recognize you. You're troublesome person. Alert, alert. Backup requested. Wait, what? What the heck is going on, man? What are these tomato bombs, dude? Uh oh, those are real uh, machines. This look dangerous. Well, you don't have to tell me that. The pink one, the beaker. Yes, avoid the green one. 
If you spill it on yourself, you will be transformed into a gooseberry. Sorry, fella. I'm at the magic lab working on the potion with Violet. All going well, although she won't stop asking me about the whole living in a book thing. Utterly obsessed. Well, anyway, seems like you two have hit a bit of an impassable there. You're not going to hop that machine by asking it politely, you know. Nope, I think you will need to stop it with a special kind of item, Jot. An item. You may find it out there on the table. Oh, is it morning time now? Whoa! Holy moly, it's... Insano... Party out here? Dude, imagine this game existing in the year 2000. Year 2000. I bet this is all huge game publishers and developers wanted. This is what they wanted, going from 2D to 3D. And it took them like a decade to do it, at least. I don't know, I don't know about Sonic. I think for Sonic, it's a special case. Sonic has been working on it for 30 years, so I don't think we've seen a good 3D Sonic yet, still. Some might argue, but some might argue... argue. <laughs> but if you brought this game to SEGA 20 years ago, brother... They would... they would, like, lose their mind. They would die. I'm in the cup. Oh, hello there. I dig your antenna. Kind of fluffy and wavy. I'm Zip. Nice to meet you. Jot, you say? You're looking for some kind of item? Well, you know, my dad could help. He's very smart. But he's currently also rather dissembled. <laughs> Some obnoxious soldiers barged into our little planet here and took him apart. They created his fragments off. Not cool at all. Hey, if you help me resemble, reassemble my old man, he will help you out. Well, he'll help you find out you're after. I'm not super confident in my jetting skills, but together maybe we could do this. How about it? If you jump out of this planet, I will hop on your back. Then we'll go looking for our dad's fragments together. We have successfully exited the home planet's atmosphere. It's my first time, no lie. It's pretty thrilling. We're in the big bad galaxy now, where the pieces of my dead have been scattered. There are three fragments. Okay, it's in the mug. And then it's in the mug. And then it's in like a little thingy, okay. My deep space thrusters are enabled. It's time to explore the cosmos. Let's jet. Woohoo! To the moon! To the moon! To the moon we go! What the heck is that sound? What's here? Why is that thing not dead? Strongest boy of all time? Is this the secret area or... Did I F up? I have a feeling that I F'd up. Who 
the moon. My perception? What happened? I thought I was in it, man. I thought I, I was on it. Perception gets a little wonky, not gonna lie. Okay. What? Jay, what happened? <laughs> Jay, you lost... You lost your... You lost your power, buddy. Was there something in there? I just sank. This is like Splunky. see many life forms around here hey before you jet off i found something shiny why don't you take it as a souvenir to remember old terry by souvenir We got one dead part. Two more out there in the galaxy. We can do this. Oh, I think we found it already. It was this one, right? Let's find one more fragment of my father before we enter here. Ah, okay. Uh oh. Oh my gosh.
Maybe this way? Yuppie! Oh, uh, no. Is that your dead? Oh, hi there! We are Ger Geraldo, the Jello King. It's our birthday today, you know. 60 years old. Oh ho! We would so much like to see a display of candles on our birthday. One lit candle for every decade of our wobbly existence. It so happens there, there are six candles placed somewhere around here. If you were to ignite them all, you would make an old king very happy. Why do I have to make this guy happy, dude? That's kind of crazy if you ask me. Yippee! Oh wait, hold on. What's this? Okay, that's a little... Aha, uh -huh. okay, one. Pretty, pretty, Grab. It must be pushing it out, right? What? No! I died! Never mind, I came right back. Don't die, it's bad for you. You know? You're not wrong. Oh. What? This is the last candle? Kinda insane with it. I'm assuming this is the first. This is the second last? Okay, this is the first one. Just need one more. Where would that be? Gone and done it. Return here for a kingly gift, dear subject. What the heck? <laughs> Happy birthday to us. Thank you, Bo, so much. You have made our day a special one. 
We decree that you shall receive a token of our royal appreciation. This metal thing! <laughs> Thank you very much! I have no use of this garbage, but here you go! For my kingly gift! On top of that, there was the scroll. I saw it and I saw it. Oh no, I cannot go down? I missed out on the rest of this part. I bet there was an item. Okay, never mind. I can't even get over it. Unless. Yep, I cannot get over it. How do I get on top of this thing? By flying, of course. No wall job, nope. Alright, I'm ready as I will ever be. I'm certain the last fragment of my father is in there. Let's go get it. It's about time, soldier. While you have been out diddly dallying, you will you we have been up to our eyeballs in Skrill. They have been blipping in and stealing our best scientists. Those buffins may be wimpy pukes, but we need them for the war. Get out there, rescue those scientists, and bring them back here to me. Also, don't die. Whoa. Whoa. Wait, what? How do I shoot? Oh, okay. I see. With the right stick. I see you, I see you. Scientist. Blue scientist. bomb Ah 
Where is this? Anomaly detected. Last scientist, you got them all. This base is full of nerds now. <laughs> They're already cooking up our next weapon. Good job, Salter. Your next mission take this piece of junk and transport it away from here. Hey, that's my dad. You call my dad junk? What the hell? It's messed up. We did it! We won the intergalactic battle. Your laser blasting was so cool. Was my jetting alright? Wait until I tell my dad. Let's get back to my home planet and put it back together. That's the mug-shaped planet where we first met. Alrighty, boy. We made it back! What an odyssey. Alright, let's reassemble Pop. Oh well, that's much better. I don't know if you have ever dis disassembled, but I really cannot recommend it. What's that? You're looking for an item? You know, there's a curious object lodged in the core of the planet. My antenna tells me it might be what you are looking for. Let's see if we can blast it out. What is that? A stamp? Stretching my jets never feel better. I hope that weird thing is what you're looking for. Thank you, young warrior. And thank you, Zip. You have done me proud. this dot got the stop stamp he can use it to imprint a magical hand icon onto the books page this icon will freeze whatever it's imprinted onto press lt to place a stamp or lt hold lt to carefully aim it glad to have you back jot looks like you have retrieved my stop stamp let's put it to good use then Dude, I had a feeling you'd be dropping in. This crazy machine just stopped cold. 
I said to myself, that's gotta be jot up to his willy tricks. Come on, let's slip on through. Whoa, this path, it doesn't normally have a giant metal disc stuck in it. What happened, bunny dude? Huge saw blade, mate. Came flying down, nearly cleaved me in twain. My life, it flashed before my very eyes. Oh man, scary stuff. Are you alright? I'm alright, mate. It was quite a useful flashback, actually. I could see where I would lose my eye. Well, that's something. God, we cannot carry on upon this... Up this path. Let's find another way around. Keep rocking on, bunny dude. These blocks look incredibly heavy. Manipulate. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. You stop. You stop. <laughs> oh, I can only do one stop. I see. Oh, that's good enough. Don't tell me we have to get another pass. Adventurers, you have climbed high. You are strong, but danger ahead. The Mega Eagle. Usually a Mega Eagle, not big trouble. But machines invading our territory make the Mega Eagle mad. Wow, that is one big bird. You may ascend. Try to avoid getting pecked to death by Mega Eagle. Oh, uh, yeah, we'll do our best. Thank you, bunny dude. Holy moly, and we climb again. Once again, our heroes scaled the perilous rock face and steeled themselves for a wild encounter. The Mega Eagle. The Mega Eagle! Seems annoying. Descending upon our heroes with a combative cry. Let's go, Thrash! Drumsticks and got ready to rumble. To rumble! Let's do it.
Let's go! Metal Warrior! The Mega Eagle soared into the starry sky. An impressed smile upon its beak. No, <laughs> it's smiling at me, dude. Thrash boy, you did good. You earned the respect of the Mega Eagle. I mean, it didn't peck you to death. You're practically a chump. You're nearly at the village now. The moment of the truth approaches. Track speed to you both. Thanks, bud. Meanwhile, across the land, at Moonbeard's house. Now then, where are we? Magic barrier spell check. The spell of rebinding all bound up. Grand. We're making good progress, Violet, my girl. Getting through it, yep, yep. Anyway, to get back to what we were talking about. Though we're characters in the book, but the people outside, like Sam, they're really real. Ah, uh, we're back to this, are we? Well, it rather depends on what you mean by real. I feel real enough, don't you? Yeah, most definitely. Well, then, we are dead. We are real in our own way. All the people outside our world are real in their way. All really real. Do you think people out there can see us? Yup, and I think I can just about make them out too. Hello there. You know, I can see... I can sense that you're out there supporting us in some way. So thank you for your efforts so far. Let's all put our best foot forward, shall we? Which means in this reality, cooking up some wicked potions. Totally on the case. Back at Trog Mountain, our heroes continued their ascent. Well, okay, what we have before us here, Jot my dude, is a wall of iron weed. It's the toughest, gnarliest plant you will ever encounter. It's usually kept at bay by the righteous gardener at Throg. But the gardener's Armia, MIA. So the iron weed is Bib, B I B. That's back in business, dude. Hello, hikers. Ironweed, huh? Tough shrub. I think I can help you out, though. I cook a mean weed killer. But I need a special ingredient. A crush room. It's like a purple mushroom. Luckily, they often grow near ironweed. If you get me one, I might be able to rustle it up. Boonbeard out. Pick one up. Good one. You've got the crush room. Hand it over, lad. Oh, we're hundreds of miles apart. Bit of a wrinkle in that plan, that. Well, maybe there's a way you could shortcut all those miles to get that shroom. God! Whoa! Good work, my boy. Bending space and time like that, champ. Now, hand me that crush room and I'll get cooking. Ta-da! A weed killer bomb. Definitely does not look like a nipple. If you throw it at the ironweed, you will dissolve it in a jiffy. Give it a go. Oh, and if you want any more bombs, I will leave a few on the ground floor on my house. Happy gardening. Good luck, Jot. There's a secret over here. 
in this very room which I don't see it oh my lord I like actually threw it that's not what I meant to do You remember the weed? You remember the weed? I remember the weed. I guess there's no teleporter here. Is there a teleporter here? Yes. How do I... Oh. oh, you little baby glitch bird. It was just the glitch bird, dude. Here were some wooden mushrooms. <laughs> I turned the mushrooms wood, dude. Wooden mushrooms. Here we are. What, well, dude? That looks potent. Be careful. Because it is. Gnarly. Moonbeer's potion always do the job. Yummy. What the heck? Bozzy reporting for duty. Intruders, no pass. God, this is the village defense system and that's Gauzy, head of security. Yo, Gauzy, my rocket fellow, we are on the way to... Intruders, no pass. Gauzy knows his job. Job description very clear. Stop intruder. But we're not... Intruder, no pass. Gauzy, head of security. Gauzy, have responsibilities. Doesn't look like Gauzy's going to budge, but we have to get past them to the village. If there was maybe some way to hold up to Gauzy for a bit. The towering pillar blasted. Heavy music. The noisy pillar was an ancient construction. Oh, more weeds. You're getting close to mountain peaks. More ironweed, huh? Ground floor, my house, more bombs. Problem solved.
Dun. I guess that does not help. This one. Is there a way to topple over this thing? Mini Moonbeer, help me. Hello there, how did I get down here so quickly? Trace secret, that is. That pillar, it's big, but it's fractured. It's not very stable, but you could tilt it over. Uh, tilt it over! Yes, of course. Did I tilt it over yet? It seems like it's not working. Okay, it worked for some reason. Let's go. Fractured pillar. <laughs> Excuse me. Very cute. I could go both at the same time. Stop! You! Err, security thread. 
Kazi feeling woozy. One more hit. My cold Kazi up. Stop. Bang, bang, bang. I want to try it the noisy. Shot across the noisy pillar. No, it doesn't work. So sad. I thought it was gonna blast music or something. Gazi, have a little lie down now. Sorry, Gazi, my dude. It's for the good of the mountain. Come on, Jot. The way to the village is clear. Whoa, a rock bunny jam session? Don't get to see those very often, Jot. They're cheering on us through the power of metal. Thanks, fluffy dudes. all dead soldier snipe i read the naughty associate behavior co uh report form it seems you are responsible for dropping that saw blade an act of sabotage or a dirty traitor i can see it in your eyes no it wasn't even me there was a rock slide shot it traitor snipe traitor and fool all around me oh how i know it well snipe I must inform you that as per the employee incompetence cause 389, we must regrettably let you go. Soldier, let Snipe go. No! <laughs> let go. Ha ha ha. Am I not extremely skilled with puns and wordplay? Indeed, oh magnificent humgrump. One of the best. The best. The best. Apologies. Oh. Masterful ones. Now get back to work! Ah, clear enough, associates. Back to work. Wait. Troublesome persons. Troublesome persons. Obliterate them. Me? God, I'm a pretty chill dude, bud. These creeps strolling around my village as if they own the place is real getting my goat. I can feel the thrag spirit rising me. It's time we kick those m marauders off the mountain. Time I stood up and joined you in the combat. For Trag! <laughs> You let my friend alone! Leave my friend alone! Rock on, dude. That was easy. Phew, that big dude panicked. Or packed a heavy punch. We thought... We taught him all pretty good, though. Huh? Let's get going. Our heroes came to a sudden halt. Ahead of them was Trag Village, wrecked by the mining blast. Oh no! And crisscrossed by giant tracks. That's not good. The giant tracks 
of a giant machine. My village is ruined. Heavy metal. That's a bad mother of a machine. I think it's going to take us... Take both of us to defeat this thing, dude. Leave my friend alone! Look, John. Those locks are explo exposed. If we can break them off, I'm sure we can stop this thing. Uh oh, that made it mad. We've got company. That saw blade went too fast. We gotta use the stop. Stop time. We'll have to work together, dude. You stop the saw blade with your sloppy power, and I'll yank this lock. Dude. I don't think so. Hey, leave my friend alone. Regulator is exposed. Give it a bash, dude. Whoa, it's out of control. The giant machine fell. Exploded on the ground below into approximately 280 million pieces. Oh, my goodness! The bigger they are, the harder they plummet off the side of a mountain. Well, no mountain troll saying that is. We rocked, dude. A perfect combo. Hey, the village folks must be around here somewhere. Let's roll on. Oh no, my people! Thrash! San, how long 
has it been? Too long, far too many days. Look at you, you're so much taller, even more handsome. Mom, come on, not in front of everyone. What? They can all see how handsome you are. Mom. Crash. We watched how you handle that me machinical monster. Mechanical, mechanical monster. Oh, you caught that then? You did great, very metal. You have the maskins of a great thrag, a trag warrior. We're proud of you, boy. Holy. Rock on. Well, you know, it's like you taught me, mom. You gotta take out the trash. Great Uncle Krong showed me some tricks. Great Uncle Krong, may he rest in glory. Good work, you two. You gave Hongrump a good old wallop. That machine was extracting metal from the mountain, you know. I have word that the Hongrump's goons are transporting the ore somewhere. For what purpose? Beats me! That's something for you to figure out. Hop on to it, lads. Shoo hoo! Wouldn't be yours out. Sounds like you have another mission ahead. Only just arrived and now you're off again. Come back to the mountain when you're done. Your little cousins want to jam with you. I'll be back soon, mom. I promise. The rest of the villagers are imprisoned around here. We'll go bust some troops ahead and break them out. Uh, track speed to you both. Track speed. To battle. Hey, dude. May I have a excavator brain? Or have I got an excavator brain? Or can you hear a clanking? Jart and Thrash looked down from the cliffside. In the very far distance, they could spy a convoy speeding away. Our heroes set off to find out where Humgrump's cavalcade was heading. Chapter 7 Beach Battle Boogie. Beach Battle Boogie! Boogie Beach. Our heroes followed the cavalcade to the coast. To the funky land of Boogie Beach. Boogie Beach. Whoa, what the heck? So here we are, Jod Boogie Beach, home of the Flare Mingos. From what I've heard, this place has serious rhythm. Let's ho uh, let's hope Humgrump hasn't totally killed the vibe. The vibe! It has been totally killed! Massive great vehicles came rolling through. Lots of soldiers with real bad attitude. You never really heard good things about Humgrump's gang, huh? Nothing about their good hygiene and impeccable manners. Well, don't worry, Flamingo dudes. We're on our way to sort this all out. Plucky Squire and company coming through. Learn to aim, bro. Holy... Oh my gosh. Quit! Don't they know I'm weak against squid? You're telling me I have to kill a squid? Okay, they're a little dramatic. <laughs> it looks like they're strangling themselves, buddy.
We buried him. Good. Ha ha ha. Hee hee hee. Nice and cozy like. We're totally justified in doing this. How'd you like these beautiful pink sand of yours now, hey, little starfish? Yo, bozos, this is exactly the type of thing that has earned you a terrible rap. Troublesome persons, get them! Excuse me, I'm stuck? What the heck was that? Those beastly bullies! They buried my poor sweet husband in the sand! Don't worry, Miss Starfish. We will soon have your dude out. <laughs> or not. That is really sturdy sa uh, sand. Uh, it's boogie sand. Very viscous. Easy to bury things. Hard to dig them out. You boys are gonna have tough time. No mistaken. There's only one fella who could dig my man out of there. Toomba? Toomba? Toomba! A little round flamingo he is. Good at digging. Find Toomba so we can dig up my sweetheart. You got it, Miss Starfish. Uh, any advice on where we would find this Toomba dude? Well, now, around this time, you will usually find him napping under a tree. Sleepy bird, that one. John, I've been scoping this place out since we got here. Didn't see any round sleepy dude around any trees. Maybe you could spot who we're after from a different vantage point? Am I blind? Boogie Beach. We have not been to... Have we been to the swamp? I don't think we have been to the swamp. We went to the Inkwood, to the Tome Tower. And then Artia. We must have been to the swamp to get to the Artia. And then Mountain and then Boogie Beach. Do you see? Because I don't see... A flamingo. Am I... Am I crazy? Am I blind? I don't have the thing to even like go back onto. Everybody. Thank you, Corey, for 105 months. Oh my gosh, how many years is that, dude? Did you play this game too? I I cannot find it, Chet. I, I think I need help. Oh my god, there it is! There is Toomba! Booby, what's what? There's a starfish buried, huh? Oh, you did play this game. Did you finish it? This guy's vibrating. Jot and Tumba beheld the Funky land of Boogie Beach. The vibe! <laughs> it has been totally killed! Wait. 
Feels like I be repeating myself. Best stuff happening, huh, Soka? You best believe it, Tumba. On my way, stay safe now. That guy is totally not cool. Holy moly. Yuppie! How long did it take you to finish it? I think it said 10 to 12 hours, I think. What the heck? What? 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 Why is there an angry boy now? They're angry babies now. Oh no. Yes? Okay. Tomba! Oh, that starfish been buried bad. Let's see what Tomba can do. Stanley! Thank Boogie, you're alright! The stand. So deep, so endless, millions of tiny primordial stones. Stanley? Banging job, Tama dude. Ooh, ouch, it, it'd be nothing. You both were here to stop all the bad business? Help you, Tamba will? Tamba's not big, but knows these beaches. And has a shovel, can dig up useful, useful thing? Tamba dude, that would be rad. We could use your help. You got it, let's roll. Rolling. Whoa. Upgrades, I will. Never mind, upgrades, I won't. Door damage upgrade 120. All right, then. Nothing? Huh, looks like Hum Grump has this place locked down. John, let's lower that gate. Somehow. Not sure on the details. Tumba has moto. When in doubt, dig. Something buried over there. Tumba help you uncover it. Dig. One of those boomy portals. Way to go, Tomba, dude. God can use this portal get to get ahead. My world is upside down, bro.
this? There's a music. Vitomba can dig it. Job, Jot. Let's get to it. Talk to, uh, <laughs> talk to it. Dig, 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 dig. <laughs> what? But I made it so they won't. Ooh. Our troubles just floated away on a breeze. Let's get going, dude. You know how it goes. Nope, not, not the page. Tilt it? Okay, that's a problem. I cannot tilt the page. It will not let me tilt. How do I get the boy then? How do I get the bird? Dig, dig, dude. Maybe I can't right now. Unless. Okay, it, it spits me out. That guy is dead? No! I don't know how to save that little boy. I'll come back for you, I promise! Apparently, it's totally seized up, won't open. Some associate didn't fill out the gear grease assess form. Very poor paperwork. A clear case for a naughty associate behavior report form. As clear a case as I have ever seen, soldier dob. Wait! Is that... Are they... Troublesome persons! Yes, you are! Well, that be a big gate. Ah. Oh, hello, gang. I found you. Violet, what the... Where did... Huh? Moonbeard didn't tell you? Oh, well, I suppose he wouldn't. He's very busy. I finished up mixing my potions. The old MB sent me here to help you two guys. Wait, who is this little pink birdie? He's so darn cute. Tamba is the name. Tamba digs holes. Tamba has been helping us navigating the beaches. Helpful dude. Hey, it's been a while. Triple trouble. Reunited. You three dancing good. Tamba cannot dance, but Tamba can dig. And Tamba can find things that aren't others can't. Tamba show you. Tumba thinking this path will take you where you're heading. Tumba! My boy! You see what I see? Art. He. Bukinir Bay water stretches to the east and west. Army hearties. 
You're in Buccaneer Bay now. If you were to be leaving, you best open the gate in. And if you were to be opening that gate, you best be finding two shiny juice. If you want to stay, you can find come live with me on me rock. Water. Be afraid. Be afraid of my combo wombo. Hold on, I'm getting a call. Hold on one second, please. Hold on one second, please. Hold on one second, please. Brother, are you kidding me? Are you are you really gonna spend spend call me right now? At this time? The spam call was, hey, would you like to have an immigration to freaking Canada, brother? Uh, answer no, because I'm already living in it. Been living in it. So you got freaking... I don't even know, man. Freaking a big dummy you are. What are they gonna do? Make me unlive the land that I've been living? Okay. A box of ice kept the starfish chilled. Sorry, brother. Still in that. His eyes now. Oh, slippery though. We have to unfreeze it so that we can hit the thing in and then get the booty. Kill 
booties. Ooh, fancy red and blue. Are you winning all the puzzles of the bait and you're beyond your way now, no doubt. Won't be living in me with me work. Ready to understand life and rocking for everyone and good luck me already. Let's go. Here was a secluded area under a leafy canopy. Little Tamba, are you going the right way? Tamba knows these beaches like the back of his wings. Tamba won't be letting you down. What the heck is this thing? To Ontario? No! Anything but Ontario! Well, actually, Ontario is not that bad. A grumpy bunker ahead. And some kind of metallic oily smell in the air. Ambush! Oh my god, there's a tank? Ahead lay dangerous looking machines. Well... Those things look mean. What the hell? What, 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 what's going on? Oh... Uh, I think my game crashed? Oh... Uh, oh, uh, what just happened? The dudes just spawned behind me, and then my speech bubble is not progressing. Oh. Uh... Oh. What happened? Please, please don't bug me out. Okay, we're back to this one. Moment of the truth. All had laid dangerous looking machines. Well, those things look mean. Okay, oh it's it's working, it's working. Okay, that was such a weird bug. Like dude spawned behind me as if I didn't kill them. And then it just didn't let me progress. Moonbeer sounds busy. He still had a lot to do when I left. I hope he remembers to hydrate. Anyway, Josh, sounds like you need an item from out there. Go do your jumpy thing.
I guess the game wanted to load in all the 3D stuff. And then I guess that caused my game to softlock, I'm assuming. What is that? A bomb? Actually, marble. Oh, I, I think I need. I, I think I need this. Crossbow is not the best weapon to use in melee. somewhere else feels free to take it I wish I was plucky what does that mean little milky don't ever doubt me son I'm high in calcium little milky there
Oh, there's a heart and there's a mouth. Dinosaurs. How many dinosaurs, man? your bomb bro <laughs> how do i get those i'll just just get close to the forehead my tail you seem like a friendly chap say maybe you can help me out there are pesky creatures running around on my back and i cannot seem to sweat swat them off could you perhaps get rid of these annoying little things You little fellow i can think again my mind is clear holy dragon got the brain dude yeah. oh my gosh that's the bedroom what the hell brother got a, like a bigger bedroom than anyone that is in the world <laughs> Brother got like the biggest house! Biggest room. I saw a tweet by library stating that if you were not to upkeep NL's desktop, he would have he would be working at Costco. Is that true? Anything that library said is not true. If you trust a single word that librarian says, it's a loss for you and your family. My goodness, you're an unusual looking dinosaur. You have the look of someone who's on a mission. You're planning to scale the volcano, aren't you? Well, it's pretty dangerous. Take that primal X over there. I'll give you the power to make it the top. Oh my gosh, I'm like angry now. Ah! Gah, ah! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eat, eat this dinosaur. Eat this. Oh no, there's a big, 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 big dinosaur. Ah! Run, 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 Pterodactyl, get out of here. Are you kidding me? Get out of my way. What the heck is this goo, dude? Who shoots the goo? You do not shoot goo.
weird. The big dinosaur does not chase me no more. I don't have to like run. Oh, hi there. What the heck? Now there's a pterodactyl, man. Get out of here. Ah, it's the big dinosaur. Never mind, we're good. Oh, hello there. Well, hello. You managed quite an impressive feat of adventuring. Getting all the way up here. My name is Time Tim. A uh, pleasure to meet you. I'm an adventurer too, you know. A time traveler as a matter of fact. I like to visit all possible futures and histories to see what I can find. Here I found lots of pointy teeth and claws. All quite thrilling. Now don't let me hold you up. You would better leave the primal X here. If it's removed, it could alter the course of history. Don't get me started on butterfly effect. Excellent. The timelines are already quite messy as they are, you know. In return, something that you may find useful. What, what do you think this is? Bomb stamp! Get bombed, bitch. An explosive development. You acquire the bomb stamp. Get back to your book and cause some shockwaves. That path back is through there, Plucky Squire. Here I go. Let's go. Righto, Jod, time to show those hom grom penny knees. What? Hom grom paninis. What your new bomb stamp can do. Get yourself on top of that book. Bro's changing its name. Select the bomb stamp. Lay on the bomb stamp. Yo, you know what I gotta do, right? Let me alternate. Power of glove. Okay, it will not let me. Maybe I cannot save the... Birdie, just yet. God, those tanks, they suddenly just blew themselves up. It must have been from boredom. They've been sitting there in the same spot for ages. Wait, dude, is this some kind of new plucky power of yours? Oh, Jod can blow stuff off now. Tomba dig, Jod blast, good combo. Mind blowing. Lead the way, Master Blaster. Yeah. Right hand, left hand. Can I try, try to? Yeah, I'll come back. 
These humgrums, dude, really love their crates, huh? They have a real talent for blocking our way. Kamba thinking there'd be another way around. Jungle full of hidden path among the trees. You clear the leaves, you find a way. Sounds promising, Jot. Maybe you could use that old plucky pizzazz. Take a look abo uh, from above, blast away some of the leaves. Hold on, it's saving. All right, let's save it right there. Seven seconds ago. No problemo. Good plucky squiring today. <laughs> 